What's up guys? Today we're back with a video on the Xbox One. I woke up bright and early just finishing up my breakfast, which was cereal and milk. Let's put the bowl there in the sink. Let's get outside and let's get the day started. Now today guys we do have some pretty big news. Over last week I put the house on the market. We've had quite a few showings and the house has officially sold. Uh, today we will be getting ready to pack on up. We have quite a few things we have to move and I'm still looking for land in the new town. Hopefully we can find something soon. We have about a week before we do have to officially move on out here. Now last episode we did mow the grass and the grass does look really good here. Probably a little bit of fertilization will really help it look green but I think we're gonna leave that to the next owners here but you guys can see the zero turn the mow at zero turn I use this for three four hours look at this guys it is covered in dust it is a bit dusty when you're mowing especially early in the season with uh, quite a few patches and dirt areas like that so let's get this let's get this washed really really quickly hopefully it just comes off pretty neat here but there is a full mods that's up on my website for all of you guys to check on out every single mod we use is up over there especially these console mods which is a lot of fun there so we got the carcher there let's kind of hop on in and let's see if we uh, bring this over here as well but guys i saw a listing over on the marketplace uh for a boat and i think we should probably go check it on out here i do want to buy a boat to go fishing uh i think a fishing trip on the local rivers the lakes even the ponds would be a pretty neat thing so i think let's go do a few other things here let's check up on charlie and then we'll uh, hop in one of the trucks and go take a look now I really do like this property. We put a lot of effort, a lot of work into it, and I can't wait for the next one here. I do have a pretty cool house in mind here that I do plan to build, but look at that guys. Every time we come over here, I always put a treat or two in there. Charlie always comes eating, and it's just so cool to have dogs here on the Xbox. Hopefully uh, in the next farm, so we do have some pretty cool things like that. But let's hop in one of the trucks, and let's go take a look. Alright, I grabbed the keys here to the 2020 TLX. What we're going to go look at here is a 10-foot inflatable boat, and it does have a Yamaha engine. I'm not sure how much horsepower, but he's only asking, I think it's like six, $700. I think that's a pretty fair deal. Hopefully, uh, we can pick it up here. Now, you guys might be asking, why are you buying something, another toy, when you're about to move? Well, this is a pretty good deal here, and we don't want to pass up an opportunity, especially since uh, spring is here. The weather's changing, and now's the time uh, to to buy it before the demand increases and I really want to go fishing and just have a great time and I think having one of these boats would be pretty cool now we do have to uh, pick up fishing gear and all that if we do end up uh, getting the boat I really do like the TLX not only as a work truck but also just to drive around town here. It is also kind of a project truck with everything we've done to it here. Definitely want to order some more things here for it but wow look at that guys. That looks even better than what I've seen here in the pictures. It does look pretty neat. Let's take a close look here at it. So it's a 10 foot boat. I think it's like 5 feet wide. Yeah that is a Yamaha look at that guys. It's 5 horsepower. That's not too much but the big thing guys when we go to let's say freshwater we just kind of unbolt the engine comes right off and then we could just put paddles here on it so it's pretty much a multi-purpose boat we could take this out into the ocean out into uh kind of right along the shoreline but also uh, we could use it here in fresh water this looks pretty good here the tires on it look great and yeah i think this is a pretty good deal i'm gonna go see if i could get it down a little bit more i would prefer maybe uh four five hundred instead of six seven hundred but let's see if we could get a deal Alright guys, I got this for $500. He did a little bit of negotiations here. I signed everything over and we do actually have to get this registered here so we could tow it. But one thing guys, these are not highway tires. So that's something we're going to have to upgrade here. They definitely look like uh, tires to just kind of go on some back roads here. But let's get it attached. Let's get back to the house. But now guys is uh, where uh, not, the not so fun part begins on getting ready to pack on up here. I do want to sell some things and I think we'll discuss that when we get back to the house here because we have so many toys and I think we could let go of some to make it easier for us to move and then maybe down the road we could end up buying some back. Now I've really been enjoying the Xbox series here. There is a lot more Xbox console videos to come as well and there will be one later on today. I definitely want to kind of do some kind of sneak peeks, some pretty cool tips, tricks about farm sim and stuff that I've learned playing on the console as well. So we'll do things like that. But I will have to say guys for being kind of back road tires, really no sway. Uh, I think all we have to do is upgrade the axle, upgrade the tires and that should be all and uh, this will be ready to go here. Maybe the next time we go camping with 
within the next few weeks here we could take this I think that would be a pretty sweet thing to bring along here with us as well but here we are we're back here at the house let's get the garage door opened up and let's get going I do uh, need to get everything packed up inside but I think I'm gonna hire movers this time to make it easier that way we do less work Right, let's get the garage door raised on up. Now, this is actually an oversized three-car garage. I don't think we need something this big when we move. Hopefully, uh, we don't have to because prices for all the materials are up quite a bit here. But you guys can see we have quite a lot of things inside. We have the toy hauler. We do have this trailer here. Actually, this trailer, I'm going to put up for sale. Maybe it sells. Maybe it doesn't. And a few other things I do want to sell is the uh, golf cart here. We just don't seem to be using it, especially with uh, the electric Cyber Quad, we don't really need this here. That Tesla Quad is really, really neat. And this was nice, but I definitely like those instead of this. So let's get this pulled on out here. We're gonna you know, post it online probably. I think I paid maybe four or five hundred dollars here for it. So I'm gonna post it for sale. It is kind of worn on out. It, it's uh, pretty old, but uh, having it out of our hands will be a little bit easier. Now the other thing, guys, we do want to sell uh, the Massey Ferguson skids here. We just haven't used it. I thought we would use it, but since we bought that new haul in, we just don't seem to be using this. So I'm going to put this up for sale. Let's see what else is in here. The snowblower, I think we'll also put up for sale as well because I don't think we get much snow where we are moving to. Drop any ideas down below, guys. Where do you think we are going to be moving to as well? Now, this trailer I'm going to sell. We don't really need it, and we do have some other trailers. So let's kind of get going. We do need to get out the this truck let's get with the uh, trailer and let's get loaded on up here because guys the house is sold in tomorrow guys we are going uh, over to the new state and we're gonna be uh, doing another video here continuation uh, so you guys are getting some extra videos here as well but let's get this backed on up here I really did like this house but it is always time for a change here let's get backed on up now we are taking that car lift with us that was a bit pricey so we're gonna keep that as well but let's get this uh, right on out and let's get everything Thing, uh, kind of loaded on up. We'll start the move and then I will finish this off camera because moving guys is a lot of work. Let's hop in the dirt buggy here. Really do like this thing. We'll be keeping this. This is actually pretty cheap as well. So that is another reason why I do want to keep this here. But oh, look at that, guys. Really quickly, the trick for these ramps is you actually just kind of have to pull forward on them. And uh, they do kind of fall down there. Not sure where exactly. I think it's because we do have a pretty big lift kit. And uh, they just kind of bottom out there. But let's get this loaded on up. And you guys can see the moving begins here. Now, this is kind of the fun uh, part. But all the boxes, all the furniture, every Everything like that, moving the couches is a lot of work and we'll hire the movers. Uh, they, they are definitely going to be doing that pretty quick here. But I think this trailer uh, should be able to fit, I would say, this and also the uh, cyber quad on it. All right, we'll get this loaded on up here. Now, we do want to put quite a few straps on these, and I don't think we'll have any problem with them shifting around here. But if you do have any cool feedback here for me, please let me know. And if you do have any guesses, guys, what map, what house uh, we are going to be moving to and building, let me know down below here. I can't wait for it. I can't wait for that video. It is going to be a pretty epic one here, and it should be tomorrow, uh, depending on my upload schedule. But that is the plan. Let's get this loaded on up. It's going to be a a little bit of a tight fit but you guys can see we started the move here I'm gonna have to do quite a few more I'm gonna have to get out the other truck as well to get everything packed on up but hope you guys enjoyed today's video here can't wait for what's to come with this series and I can't wait for uh, some fishing trips things like that uh, this spring this summer and throughout uh, many uh, trips as well Ho hope you guys enjoyed today's video thanks for watching stay tuned for next one and subscribe for more